Hello, family and friends. This is Beverly Black, and I pray that everybody is doing well today. Today, we are in the kitchen, and we are going to be making some squash casserole. Very simple, easy to make. So stay tuned, if you don't know how, to learn how to make this squash casserole. I have already prepped and got the ingredients ready to go. And for this squash casserole, what you will need is six squash sliced up. This is six of them sliced up. One small onion diced up. One cup of cheddar cheese. A half a cup of Parmesan cheese. A half a cup of sour cream, one sleeve of buttery crackers crushed up, and butter. That is it. That is all your ingredients. And we are going to go ahead and cook the squash and the onions. And the squash, you can either boil them to their tender or you can cook them in a skillet and some butter until they're temp uh, tender. What I like to do is cook the squash in one pan and the onions in another pan. It makes uh, a lot of difference in the taste of your squash casserole. I have put two tablespoons of butter in each skillet. So we're getting ready to, I'm going to fry my squash or, and saute the onions. All the onions are in the skillet. And you don't have to add any water because squash makes a lot of water in itself. So you don't need to add any water in it. And we're just cooking them until they're tender. The squash and the onions are done. Here are the squash. Now you may want to boil this. It's, it's faster boiling it than it is cooking it in the skillet. So we're going to drain it. You see all this water? You see the water that is left in that in here? So we're going to... I got it in the colander and we are going to drain out as much water as we can squash has a lot of water in it and some people when they make that squash casserole they put um rice in it you can put rice in it if you want to i don't do it but some people do i just like it simple i'm gonna squeeze it Move it back so some more of this water can come out of it. See, water is still coming out of it. We're getting ready to combine all our ingredients. Here are the onions. I have the oven preheated at 350 degrees. 
So we're going to add the squash. We're going to put in the cup of cheddar cheese. the half a cup of Parmesan cheese. And I had a little bit of Parmesan cheese left, just a tad, I think I'm going to put it all in there. Okay. Now we're going to put in the sour cream, a half a cup of sour cream. And you put salt and pepper to taste, to your taste. Okay. I'll mix all of this together. Some people put eggs in, in their um, squash casserole. I don't put eggs in mine. It's just simple and good. I think I'm going to put a little more cheddar cheese in it. And this is mild cheese. Okay, I'm going to put some salt and pepper in it now. Pepper. this up. I have melted two tablespoons of butter in the skillet and the sleeve of crackers that I crushed up. I'm going to put in there and we're going to coat them good. Make sure all the crackers get a little butter like this okay now we're ready to put our casserole together I am going to spray my dish, spray the bottom of your dish. I'm going to pour the mixture in. Remember you do your salt and pepper to your, you taste it and see when you have enough to your taste. Okay. We will put this in the oven for about 20 to 25 minutes, depending on your oven or until the crackers on top are brown. Okay, let's add the crackers. getting ready to put this in the oven and see how she looks when she comes out 
This is your squash casserole. And here it is. And I will be back when it has um, cooked for about 20 minutes or 25 and it's golden brown. The casserole is out of the oven and piping hot. And it looks very good and smell good. First of all, I'd like to thank everyone who came by today and who spent time in watching this video. I am getting ready now to get some out so I can show you. You see how it is smoking. It is hot, but it looks so good, so good. Look at there. You can even see the cheese in it. I would like to thank all my members, those who are in the membership here on this channel. Thank you so much. And those who want to just hit that join button where, where it says um, members and become a part of us. I would appreciate it. Remember everyone, I love you, but God loves you more. Why? Because you are his masterpiece. Everyone be blessed and prosperous. Bye-bye.